First and 10 on News 10 ABC Sports. Welcome back to First and 10. Earlier this week, 11 Troy varsity football players were suspended for at least a week for vandalizing property while carrying out an annual prank. Four seniors were also kicked off the team. That leaves a lot of holes to fill, especially heading into a huge divisional matchup with Bishop McGinn. My teammate Josh Rolenberg joins us live from Bleecker Stadium. And Josh, this was just an uphill battle. Liana, it was a tough week for the Troy football team. Down all those players, like you said, including their two quarterbacks. Elijah Thomas, one of those seniors, kicked off the team. And Zach Johnson suspended for two games. And tonight, the Flying Horses had the tall task of facing the undefeated Bishop McGinn Griffins. There you see Zach Johnson and Dewan Hudson. They were spectators tonight. Elijah Bethel would try his hardest to carry the horses. But down six, Troy's first play from scrimmage. Bethel coughs it up. And Ayub Ward is Johnny on the spot. He recovers the ball. McGinn answers off the turnover. Josh Shear Weaver takes the pitch, bounces it outside, breaks a tackle, and he's gone. The Griffins' two-point try would fail, but they go up 12. Second quarter this time, it's Kyir Tillery. And all Troy could do is get a hand on him. McGinn sprinting out to a 20-6 halftime lead. And it didn't get any better for the horses in the second half. Weaver, though, with a play of the night nominee, 80 yards to the crib. He finished with 139 and the two scores as McGinn wins easily 34 to 6. I'm just focusing on the guys that played. I'm real proud of those guys and the effort they gave forth. And I will live and die with those guys any day of the week. It's a great victory for us. Uh, I know they were down some of their players and that hurt them. But I told our kids, you know, that's kind of a rallying point for the rest of their guys. They have a good program. But McGinn was the better program tonight. The Griffins are now 5-0 for the first time since 2008, back when they went to the Super Bowl. And as for Troy, like we said, Zach Johnson out another week, so Coach Herto is going to have to figure something out, Liana.